Okay, we need to be very quiet. What are you doing? You insane? Or just stupid? Look at these, what are these monsters? Let's just send a volley down there and try and take care of them. Excellent, I think that's done the job. One of them's trying to sneak up on us, Rex. We can't have that. It's kind of glitched into the ground there. <laughs> we'll take care of him. There we go. Excellent. Well, that's a fucking monstrosity. I'm glad we're cleaning up the wasteland, yes. We're just gonna equip um, our rebreather and our spacesuit because it's got damage resistance. It's a very good look for us. Yes, and what have we got here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Who are these? Brotherhood of Steel Paladin. Wowee Rex, we've got some free power armor. Fantastic. And lucky I just dropped a bunch of my shit so we can carry it. Is there anything that gives away what they were doing? Brotherhood of Steel Mission Holotape. Wow, Rex. Let's get out of this radiation crater here. And away from these abominations. And I think we should stay hidden, Rex, because there might be some Brotherhood of Steel nearby. Let's read this and see if we can find out anything. Paladin Hughes and Fairbanks, I need you two to head north to the nearby communications array and look for the components mentioned in the briefing. These mutants have been reasonable. Oh, well, McNamara, I kind of killed them. We kind of, well, it was Rex. I didn't kill them, okay? Rex killed them. Lucky it's such a clear night and we can make out what looks like a, a hidden bunker. Wow. Oh no, <laughs> I spoke too soon. We better get in here, Rex. Get out of the sandstorm. Get out of the dust storm. Okay, Rex, keep on guard. We're here um, for academic purposes, Rex. We're just here to learn stuff. Okay, we've got Owen and Lars from New Hope, a suitcase with some pre-war money, which we do not need. Some wine, which we of course do need. Make sure betting. Let's see if we can talk in the intercom. Hello? Okay, okay. Lucky I'm a master lock pickerer. And we can just break in here, Rex. Yes, there we go, and oh, it's a... <laughs> it's completely collapsed. Well, Rex, false alarm. False alarm. Should we get... Should we get an hour's sleep, I reckon? Let's just get one hour's sleep on this bed. That's all we need, okay? Burnt guy doesn't sleep much. You know, he has a lot of PTSD after the burning incident. Uh, my memory's a little hazy. Jesus Christ. Is there any more information we can get from this uh, temporary password? The better part of valor. There you go. Okay, so there's a password, Rex. Let's see if we can find another entrance around here. And we <laughs> Scorpions didn't have a chance. And we can maybe, um, maybe sneak in. I just can't see shit. Can we get in here? No. <laughs> Fuck. Rex, I think I'm lost. I think we're very lost. We might have to think about camping for the night. There's just gotta be another secret entrance. I feel like we're gonna walk over it at any second. Oh. <laughs> Rex, where are you? Okay, well, I'm, I'm going in. Okay, Rex, we know a password now, so let's see if we can say that into the intercom. See what happens. We'll just do a quick save, because I don't know. I feel like Brotherhood of Steel are very well armored and very well equipped in terms of arsenal. We really don't want to piss them off. Let's just run into these barrels, you know, get a little warm up. Okay, Rex, you ready? <laughs> Here we go. I look so fucking scary. Come on, there's no way. Okay, let's try that password. The password is uh, the better part of Bella. Oh shit. Stay where you are. I'm sending someone up to meet you. Okay. I don't know. Oh, why is the door closed? I don't know if I like that, Rex. Okay, good. It's it's not locked. Oh! I don't like this, Rex. It's exactly what I said. They've got guns. Luckily, he's very slow with his walking, so we can just kind of... We can just kind of back out of here, Rex. <laughs> okay. Listen very closely and do as I say. Your life depends on it. Really? And over everything you're carrying. Weapons, ammo, clothes, armor, everything. I want you stripped down to your underwear. What's going on here? I told you what to do. Strip off your clothes uh, and equipment or face summary execution. Will you comply? I am the only one who deals out justice in the wasteland, okay? I won't comply. Makes things simple for us. Yes, it does. Vilified, fuck off. 
Oh Jesus. What happened there? He kinda he kinda popped. Good boy, Rex. Good boy. Now get in there. Get God, you killed him instantly! What happened there, Rex? <laughs> you got him. Okay, there we go. Apparently I've lost karma for some reason, even though these guys are trying to strip me naked. Apparently it's not a crime to fucking command someone to strip naked. Or oh, maybe next time I'm out in the street, maybe next time I'm out in the street of New Vegas, I'll tell some woman to strip naked. I'm sure that'll go well. Well, Rex, fantastic. Okay. Fuck the Brotherhood, I don't care. I bet their quests are fucking boring anyway. I bet they're fucking boring fetch quests. Oh, my... My Brotherhood companions are out in the wasteland. I'm sure they're not dead. Meet up with them. Well, Rex, we're out of ammo. You know, we need more microfusion cells. I think it's time to go into New Vegas and do some shopping. Yes! Okay, Rex, another beautiful day in the Mojave and oh my god, what is happening here? Hey, guys. Howdy. Hey there. Need anything? In fact, I do. What have you got? Sure. Here's what I've got. Uh... This is all pretty trashy. Yeah. Katana, authentic blade. Wow. Wow. Metal armor, leather belt. That sounds kinky. Here we go, mini nuke. Excellent. This is what we need. Wow. Okay, Rex, I'm pretty sure there's a stop and shop up here. And we can see what they've got. Maybe chat to some lovely ladies. Yes, Rex, what do you think of that? Wowee. You know, Burnt Guy, uh, Burnt Guy, uh... We, um... We haven't really had much loving, you know, since... Since whatever happened to us, God, God knows. <laughs> hey there, Michelle. Back for more? Yeah, um, I kind of want to see what you have for sale. I can't remember. Have a look. Do you have any nukes or anything for me? Jesus fucking Christ, you have nothing. You have absolutely nothing. God. Another satisfied customer. Not really. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Who's this, though? Veronica. I like your fucking Smurf outfit you got going on here. How's it going? No offense, but you look like you've traveled a long way down some bad roads. <laughs> Where'd you come from? I came from the grave. No, I, look, I came from Good Springs. Wow, you have come a long way, then. I've never been there... But don't, I've met some traders who don't passed go there. <laughs> Trust well, me. <laughs> welcome then. I'm Veronica. I live in a hole in the ground. Aha. Uh -huh. That's funny. I kind of just visited a hole in the ground. Well, a bunker, if you want to get technical. Oh. I think it sounds more interesting my way. Uh huh. But I'm not there much anymore. I'm usually out here picking up food and supplies for my family, whatever they need. Right. So you just leave your family in the bunker? Yeah, I'm not worried. They can handle themselves. But somebody has to get the groceries, know what I mean? <laughs> no and much. actually these days, I think they'd rather have me out here anyway. But that's a whole other story. Well, they sound like dicks. So listen, can Ooh. I ask you something on the level? Go ahead. I had a run-in with this group calling themselves the Brotherhood of Steel. Oh, really? Pretty strange bunch. Do you know anything about them? Um, yeah. I met a group of them in a bunker west of here. But I don't think I'm going to say that. I think I'm just going to say they're harmless. Unless you have advanced technology around them. Because I'm so smart. Well, that shouldn't be a problem for me. I can't afford anything like that. I can. Hey, so where are you headed anyway? Um... I go where I'm needed. Guess we have that in common then. I'll be honest. You're the first person I've run across out here that mm -hmm. looks like he can really handle himself. Yeah. There are places I've never been to that'd be too dangerous for just me. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Maybe we could travel together. Help each other out. Well, that sounds kinky. Uh, you don't look like much. What do you bring to the table? <laughs> Where are you hoping to go? Oh, nowhere in particular, really. Just hoping to see more of the world. Looking for a fresh perspective. Looking to see... I want to a... see how different groups have adapted to survive in the Mojave. See if there's something I can learn from. Are you looking to see a burnt dick? Um, don't you have a family to feed? Like I said, they can handle themselves. And I'm not the only one getting supplies for them. It's a big family. Right. Okay, let's do it. Fuck it, guys. We'll have the holy Triforce, the trifecta. Let's do it. Now you're talking. One thing you should know first, though. What's that? I ask you about the Brotherhood because I'm one of them. Oh. <laughs> I know, I know. But I had to know how you react when I told you. Uh -huh. We have made a lot of enemies. Mm. You still okay bringing me along? 
Sure. Actually, I'm more comfortable now that I know you've had some training. I'm great at punching people. I'm not gonna lie. It is a gift. Well, uh, thanks for taking a chance on a naive young girl from California with stars in her eyes and a pneumatic gauntlet on her hand. Sweet ass. Let's hit the road, huh? Let's do it. Fuck yes. Wow. Look, wow. Look at this group. Isn't this fantastic? Gosh. Gosh. Well, Veronica, um, fuck it. Let's go to the strip. Let's have, let's go get fucked up and get some strippers and shit. What do you say to that? Let's do it. This place doesn't look too friendly. Let's have a little look in here. I thought I heard something. Oh, look, it's a doggy. It's a little doggy. You a friendly doggy? You are. Hello. Who's your good boy? Meet Rex. I'm sure you two will be great friends. Oh, look, another doggy. Who's up here? Hello. There, Violet. What you want, freak show? Uh. What's the deal with all the dogs? Dogs? Good dogs. My dogs. Fiend dogs. Tear you up. Arf, arf, arf. Uh, arf, arf. <laughs> nice doggies want a treat. Hey! No feeding my dogs! Holy shit. So what exactly are you on? <laughs> Good shit. Psycho. Top quality. You on? Might know a guy who knows a guy. Uh, yeah, hook me up. No. Uh-huh. More for me. Okay. What do you know about Driver Neffy and Cook Cook? I've heard these names before. Are they friends of yours? Don't fuck with fiends. Driver Nephi will brain your skull in. Cook, cook, cook. You don't even know what he'll do. Okay, bye bye. Oh, wait, who are you? Who wants to know? You here for my dogs? Can't have my dogs? Here for meat? You can't have my meat. Meat's for dogs. I'm Violet. Dogs are mine. Meat is mine. Well, that's fair enough, dude. Um, great to chat to you. Piss off. <laughs> I like this girl. Veronica, you got some fucking rivalry here. You got some competition. I don't know if I want you around me. I kind of want Violet to hang out with me. You know, she seems like a cool girl. She's got her priorities set up, you know, spends all day fucked up on cams, mutilated bodies all around. I don't know why this one's in a bed. Don't you want a bed? Okay, well, bye-bye. Let's go see if we can find Driver Devi and Gook Gook. See if we can have a chat with them. I reckon they're hanging out in here. Wow, these guys sure do know how to live. They've got their own vault here, hello? Buddy. Oh, who's this? Cook Cook, my boy. Something on your mind? <laughs> You're on my mind, Cook Cook. Uh, who are you? Who am I? I'm the scariest motherfucker you ever gonna meet. I'm <laughs> Cook Cook, bitch. Better not forget it. <laughs> Why do they call you Cook Cook? If I had to guess, it's because I cook shit for the rest of the gang. I'm a good cook. Maybe I'll make you dinner sometime. Wow, wait. That sounds like a date. So you cook all these animals around here? That's right. Ramen, mole rats, lizards, the occasional traveler lost in the wrong part of town. Not Queenie, though. I'd never cook my Queenie. Who's Queenie? What's a Queenie? That's Queenie. She's the prettiest Brahmin in the wastelands. Aren't you, Queenie? Yes, you are. Who's a good girl? <laughs> <laughs> you got a little pet, how sweet. I've never been more disturbed in my entire life. I'll just say you got a little pet. Yes, you are. Yes, that's right. <laughs> um... Do you know Violet and Driver Nettie? Of course I do. You want to meet them, eh? Even money where the Violet's dogs rip you apart, or Nephi caves in your skull with that iron of his. Okay, well, goodbye. Yeah, whatever. Well, guys, we need to find Driver Nettie. Driver Nettie, yes. Do you reckon he's down here in Vault 3? I think he might be. Door is activated elsewhere, gosh. Oh, here we go. Excellent. Wow. Wow, guys. We're making new friends. What the fuck are you doing here? You got some kind of fucking death wish, asshole? I'm carrying Jet, Psycho, and other famous. I don't deliver to the help. If you're fucking carrying, just fucking say so. Yeah, deliver to the boss. Business as usual. Excellent. Motor runners down in the maintenance wing. Straight through the door behind me, down the hall, down the stairs to the right. Wowee. We have a con coming through to see the boss. Don't shoot at him. Okay. Let's just do a save here, guys. <laughs> just in case. Just in case things turn south. Disarm the grenade, bro. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Oh, watch out, Rex. Jesus! Fucking morons. Oh. Everything okay? <laughs> we got another mine here. There we go. Hey, buddy. 
Bryce, what's going on? How the hell did you get in here? And who the hell are you? Uh, I'm Burnt Guy. What can you tell me about this place? What are you looking to find out? Tell me what an NCR Ranger is doing here. Tell me why I should tell you anything. I don't know you. I'm an independent contractor with the NCR. Oh, my apologies, sir. I was sent here by Colonel Shu to exterminate Motor Runner, the leader of the Fiends. Right. Colonel Sue sent me to find you. He sent you? Why? Uh, the Colonel was concerned. You missed your check-in. Uh... You can go back to Old Shu and tell him that the mission will be completed. I just need a couple more days. What's the hold-up, if you don't mind me asking? What's it look like? I caught one in the leg. I killed a dozen of those degenerates sneaking my way in, but one got a drop on me. That's no good. I hold up here after I killed that one. They're too stupid to unlock the door, so I knew they'd figure whoever attacked had just taken off. I just need a day or two, then I'll take out Motor Runner myself. I even got his key to the maintenance wing. Situation's under control. Why don't you give me the key? Uh... Hmm... I'm afraid your leg looks like it smells like bird's infection. God damn it. I know. I was just hoping that, uh... Are you trained as a doctor? I am. Can you fix my leg? Burnt guy can fix your leg. I have a doctor's bag right here. It should be enough to get you on your feet. What are you waiting for? I've got a high-value target to kill. Well, hang on. Well, hang on one second. Thanks for the assistance, Doc. Time for us to go take out Motor Runner? Yeah. Um, I could use your help. Okay. Okay, I'll follow you down to Motor Runner. Here, take the key to the maintenance room. Now, I like to know, mm, put that knife away, diplomacy first, okay? If we can talk to these fiends, you know, give them a few cams, get a few filthy, dirty, street blowjobs, then, you know, we may as well. It's a 5.56 millimeter rounds, terminal. Okay, I think I've seen what I need to see. Let's get out of here. Let's get going. The maintenance wing, huh? The maintenance wing. Now, the fiends are my friend, okay? Bryce, so just be good. Be a good boy, okay? <laughs> be nice. Now, we need to find that maintenance wing, wherever that is. Look at this. You ready to die? Oh, uh. Here he goes. Oh, you don't seem too well. You hear about this courier doing shit around the strip? Like what, delivering mail? That's incredible, you can talk whilst you're... Could you open this terminal for me? No, I'll do it. Oh, hey! Here's my boy. Okay, let's do a little save. Just in case. <laughs> and let's talk to this guy. I wasn't expecting a resupply so soon. So you have anything from Red Rock Canyon to sell me? Uh, yeah. Um, can you tell me what happened to the residents here? I guess it isn't a secret. Yeah, the residents of the vault are all dead. We killed them. <laughs> Funny thing is, they just let us in. We didn't have to force the doors or anything. Why did you move the fanes into this vault? We needed some place to put down roots. I was having trouble keeping my people out of Westside. Right. What's going on in Westside? I try to keep my people out of Westside. Apart from trying to stay on good terms with the cons who do business there, there's mean son of a bitch. That fucking mutant is more trouble to kill than to avoid. Having some place for my people to sleep reduces the chances of drifting into West Side. Hmm. Um, I have some camps that I can sell. I'm paying 20 caps each for jet, psycho, or buff out. Okay. Um, I can sell you psycho for 20 caps. Okay. Oh, that's about it. No. <laughs> One thing of Psycho. That is all I can spare. Okay, then. What's your business? Nothing. I'm just leaving. Then get the fuck out. I'm a busy man. I can oh, see how busy you are. Yes. Isn't he any biggie? Bone Nash and Nash Bone. Isn't this guy busy? He's so busy. Wow, look how busy he is. Look how busy he is. Yes. Should we kill them all or should we take care of mean son of a bitch? I think we should take care of mean son of a bitch. Yes. Wowee. Okay, well, let's go through to Westside and investigate, you know? Don't you guys think, Veronica? 
Rex, um, we'll see if we can find this mutant and take care of it. Because I like these fiends. They seem like they, they know what they're doing. Um, Drive an Effie, I've heard so much about you. Who the fuck are you and why are you bothering me? Um, who are you? Name's Nephi, friend. Driver Nephi. Pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you. It is, really? No, you fucking dolt. Why the hell would it be a pleasure? <laughs> it's a nice club you've got there. Fucking ain't right it is. This baby's my life, my love, my strong right arm. Uh-huh. Killed a lot of fuckers with this hunk of iron, yes sir. Yes sir. So it's a golf club, that's why he's called Driver Nephi. Okay, well goodbye. Get fucked. Okay. <laughs> I love these guys. These guys are awesome. Okay. Well, let's go through to West Side and we'll take care of that super mutant. So this is West Side, right? West Side, West Entrance. With, with, with. Let's have a little look around here. God, what a lovely little town. Oh, here he is. Main son of a bitch. Hey, buddy. Uh, hi. Uh, who are you? Marshal Fabish. Okay, nice to meet you, Master Vabish. My pleasure is on my goodbye. Well, he seems like a nice guy as well. Gosh, I don't know if I want to take sides, guys. I don't know if I want to take sides. Judah Krieger, hello. You don't strike me as someone down on their luck. What brings you to West? It's true, I have 16 million caps. Welcome to Casa Madrid. Cheapest, cleanest whores in all Ooh. New Vegas. If you want to know the rates for Poon, talk to the whores. I would like to know the rates for Poon. Where are these women? Prim oh. has a new sheriff. Oh my god. That should keep the powder gangers away. What do you think, guys? Should we sleep with Maud? Hey, Maud. Hello, stranger. You looking for a good time? <laughs> Dear god. Uh, goodbye. You know where to find me, honey. Hey, mister. Looking to relax? Looks like you carry a lot of tension in your shoulders. And upper thighs. Uh, I'm good. Okay, bye. See you. I think this was a mistake, guys. Maybe we sh- Howdy. Oh, she- Oh, oh, oh. Uh, okay, guys. You're gonna need to wait outside. <laughs> you're gonna need to wait outside, okay? I have urges. Sweetie. Hey, baby. What say you and me get acquainted? Uh, that sounds good. Uh, tell me about yourself, sweetie. I'm called sweetie because I'm the sweetest piece you'll ever find anywhere outside of the strip. How much does it cost to hire you, sweetie? It's worth every cat, baby. I'll do things to you you didn't even think was possible and leave you feeling like everything's right in the world. Wowee. 300 caps, Jesus, fuck. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I got 16 million. Here's your money. I'm gonna make your toes curl, baby. Well, thank you for a great time, sweetie. Uh... Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, shit. We have a problem. Guys, we have a problem. Quickly, get in here. Get in here, guys. We have a problem. We have a problem. Quick, get in. <laughs> get in, get in, get in. Close the door, damn it. Close the damn door. Okay, we have a problem, guys, okay? I don't know what I did, okay? But she couldn't handle it, and now she's dead. I'm not sure. Okay, we need to dispose of the body. We need to take care of her quickly. We need to... Huh. <laughs> that was easy. She's gone. Excellent. Excellent. 